Welcome to the Ed Hoddle Show for week number three as Stevenson returns home for a two-game homestand. And the first game of that homestand is a matchup with the defending MAC Conference champion, Delaware Valley Aggies. I'm James Wagner, assistant AD for Athletic Communication here with Coach Ed Hoddle. And Coach, uh, last week, Lemon and Valley went on the road for the first time. Uh, not the outcome you would have liked, but uh, your thoughts on that game against Laval? Uh, tough afternoon for sure. Um, we showed our youth in a number of perspectives. Um, we showed our inexperience in, in the other perspectives. So um, good learning experience for us. You know, we, we talk to the guys all the time. You learn far more in defeat than you do about yourself in victory. So um, opportunity to learn, opportunity to grow, opportunity to, to gain some valuable game experience for our guys. And, um, you know, excited for the challenge ahead. You know, I looked at the the play by play and I saw that last drive. You guys, you know, there it was kind of there were short drives all over the game. Even Love Val the same way, uh, but you guys put that that long sustaining drive you got to about the nine yard line towards the end of the game. Is that something that you talk about the youth that you were able to build on going into this week? I think so. You know, so much of what you're able to accomplish is, is confidence based. You know, I don't think we're playing with a great deal of self confidence right now, and. Um, you know, something we talk to our guys about, you know, fairly frequently is going out and being confident in what you're doing. And, you know, that confidence comes from a couple of places. It comes from on-field experience and it comes from the weight room. Um, so, you know, two areas that, that, you know, we've got to continue to improve upon and, and continue to grow in. And, um, you know, I think every time you do something positive, it, it helps you to build for sure. Going into this game, obviously, Delaware Valley, MAC champion the last couple of years, played them tight last year. Uh, what can we expect out of the Aggies today? Uh, you know, they're, they're kind of the same, you know, they're big, they're physical, they're athletic, um, well coached and, you know, we're going to have our hands full for sure. And then obviously now you have a two game homestand where you don't have to go on the road again until October. How does that help with it, with a youthful team like you have? You know, I, I think it's the consistency and how they're able to prepare. You know, you're not worried about hotel rooms. You're not worried about bus rides. You're sleeping in your own bed. You're, you know, we're eating, eating breakfast in the cafeteria. It's our locker room. So developing that consistency to help build some of that confidence as we head into, you know, the, the back half of the season where we're going to be on the road way more than we're home. So we're going to have to, you know, work to overcome those obstacles as well. But, you know, two weeks at home, you know, heading into the bye is certainly something to be excited about. What are some of the keys that you guys are going to need to, to focus on today? You talk about consistency, both offensively and defensively. You know, we haven't done a great job taking the football away. Um, and we've not done a very good job of taking care of the football. So I think, you know, prime th those have to be top of mind throughout, you know, today and and, and our games moving forward. You know, we've got to win the, the turnover battle and um, we've not done that yet. Um, but something we're aware of, something our, you know, our, our guys are certainly keen to and something we're going to continue to talk about. All right, Coach, good luck today. Thank you very much. All right, first of a two-game homestand. The Mustangs taking on the Aggies at Delaware Valley here at Mustang Stadium. Thank you all for joining us, and go Stangs.